Richard, a trip to Whitehaven this weekend, a long trip and a, a testing one as well. Yeah, it's one of them um, on the road, long journey to overcome. Um, so the start's going to be huge for us, making sure we start well um, and hopefully it'll set, put us in good stead for the rest of the game. A long turnaround between games as well, do you think that'll help maybe ease the journey a little bit? Yeah, it will, yeah, it has. It's going to give us an opportunity to get a few bumps and bruises uh, sorted out um, coming into this game. Uh, making sure everyone's fit and, and, and good to go. So, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a game we're looking forward to. And of course, one defeat so far this season, the majority wins on paper so far. We've, we've done really well so far this season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, frustrating, obviously, we didn't we didn't get that, the, the, the one that sort of the Unslet game, mm. but um, we'll live and learn from that. Um, again, up against a real tough opposition, really big middle, uh, really big pack, and in probably good form and good spirits after a really big cup win. Yeah, the, the Cumbrian sides are always tough to beat on their own patch, aren't they? Are you expecting another physical encounter this weekend? Yeah, certainly. Um, I'm hoping it stays dry so we can play some some, some footy, but um, knowing going up there at this time of the year, it's going to be wet and a, a bit soft underground, so um, our middles are going to have to be good. Uh, of course, a few games into the season now, are you starting to see the boys maybe getting into that groove, particularly obviously on the training ground as well? Yeah, certainly, but obviously conditions are, are probably hampering all that. Um, what you see on a training field isn't really replicated on a field due to the rain coming, the strong winds at the moment, so uh, it's hard to, to be as fluent as you want them to be um, and move the ball about like, you'd, like I'd like them to um, due to them conditions. So um, the middles are having to do the uh, majority of the work at the moment. With the strong winds as well, if that lasts until Sunday, how much of a, of a sort of onus is going to be on the kicking game, short and long at times? Yeah, huge. Um, uh, again, they've got a big middle, so we'll have to get behind our kicking game and make sure that's good. Because um, if we do do that and keep them away from uh, our end of the field, um, I'm confident we can get the job done. And obviously with the, the longer weekend last week, have the players looked fresh in training this week? Yeah, they've been good. Um, obviously a bit of breaks always good uh, probably a bit early in the season for, for a long turn around uh, so they're still fresh as it is um, could do with this sort of back end of the year uh, but yeah we'll take it um, yeah they are, they're all looking good all looking fresh um, and, and raring to go for weekend really and, and, and just get back out on the field of course a couple of cup draws have been made this week at the 1895 Cup West Wales at home Challenge Cup Featherstone Lions away from home what did you make to those two draws yeah they've been fairly kind to us aren't they the, the draws so um, but no, yeah, we'll we'll prepare um, how we would for any game uh, to go out there and perform and to get the result. And um, no, we don't want any slip ups against any amateur teams. So, and I know they they they're a well drilled team, and uh, depending on where we play them at as well, uh, it might be a leveler for them.